In this session, we're going to look at importing a SQL database into our web server. So we're using PHP MyAdmin, and we'll be importing the SQL data file into there. So first of all, we need to head to PHP MyAdmin. So if you go to your account and put PHP MyAdmin on the end of it, you'll be able to log in. Remember that the username is root and the password is blank. And once we're in here, there are no databases currently in here that we've imported, so we're going to go straight up to import. Then we're going to import an SQL database, so we need to choose the file. So we're going to navigate through to where the file is stored. And click on open SQL. So now we have our Shipwreck master SQL file, and you may have another database, and then all we have to hit is go. You can tell by the alert that we've successfully imported uh, 243 records. And now we can click on shipwrecks and then select the table. And we can see all the data that's been imported into our database. Now we can head back to code anywhere and start writing some PHP to query our database.